Hey everybody, Mr. Clayton here, and I'm here today with Miss Abby. We're going to go ahead and take you guys through a extreme skills drill, which is focusing on the social distancing curriculum for the skill strength. The name of this game is called Freeze It, and you won't need any equipment besides a chair for this drill. What we're going to be demonstrating on this one is to focus on the student's leg muscles by working a side kick, but in a frozen position where they are holding the exold, or full extension of the actual kick itself. From there, the students are going to try to hold it for an extended period of time, and on round number one, it's going to equal a total of 30 seconds. Then on round number two, they're going to push to go to a minute. And then on round number three, they're going to try to hold for an entire minute and 30 seconds as, as they go through this one. At any point in time, if the instructor notices that the student's leg starts to drop or lose that technique, then they can ask them to stop and have a seat until the next round starts. So let's go ahead and see if Miss Abby can do it. All right, guys, Miss Abby is the first player up for this one. So we're going to go for round number one, which will be 30 seconds. So she's going to chamber one leg up and extend and we're holding. Nice job. So on this one, again, it's really important for the students to focus in on that squeeze of their leg, trying to hit with that proper part of the foot. You see Miss Abby's got her toes down, she's got her hand up. She's holding that position so that way she's working the correct technique as she goes through. If, again, the instructors start to see the knee bend or a drop, that's where we can say stop time and have them take a knee. And let's go ahead and stop it there. Great job, Miss Abby. So, again, you saw on that one, Miss Abby was able to extend. She does this drill a lot, so it's really not too difficult for her now. But again, as you're going through with the extreme skills kids, it may be a little bit tougher for them to hold that full extension and keep it there for an extended period. So, make sure you give them those challenges. Three takeaways for this drill. First off, you guys want to make sure that you guys have that leg that you're using super straight as you're doing this one, so that way it actually works the correct muscle groups as you play. Second takeaway, keep your head in the right position as well. If you start to take your head and dip it over or move it, you're going to be altering the positioning, which could take away from the strength that you need. And then the third and final takeaway for this one is obviously don't give up. Once you start to do this game correctly, it will start to really challenge those muscles in your leg. So keep pushing and don't give up so you can get stronger. Go ahead and go through this drill for two to three rounds to make sure that every player gets multiple chances to play.